This is it. I have to do this now. If I can't prove he's Yogi right here, right now, then I've got nowhere else to go. Nick, how are you going to prove it? How can you prove that he's the Yogi? I don't know, it's, it's okay, it's actually quite simple. Your Honor, please take this man's fingerprints. Oh boy. Then we'll compare them to the fingerprints on file for Yanni Yogi 15 years ago. Except Karma has that file. I oh, see, that makes sense! Tisk, tisk, tisk. Huh? I'm so very, very sorry, Mr. Wright. What? Well, why? The witness has no fingerprints. What? Are they burned off or something? Was it? What? What? No fingerprints? Is he gonna sh what? Er, you see, before I worked as a caretaker, I worked in the chemical plant! I burned my fingers working with the stuff. Er, uh, yep! Uh huh. Show us these fingerprintless fingers of yours. Well, what? Yogi, you sneak. You burn your fingerprints off to hide your past. Of course he. Hmm! Well, if the witch has no fingerprints, I guess we will not be able to prove his identity. DNA, perhaps? No. Tsk, tsk, tsk. What will you do, Mr. Wright? Uh. Hmm? It seems that the case has been decided. No. No. Haha. <laughs> I, knew, I knew exactly what I was going to say. I know what happened. I know everything. I, I just can't prove it. But no, I can't let it end like this. I can't lose. There has to be another way. There is no one who can testify as to who this witness is. No one. Nick, what are we going to do? I didn't even consider that he might have erased his fingerprints. What do I do? Tisk, tisk, tisk. Well, Mr. Wright, perhaps you'd like to cross-examine the parrot for a little comic relief, hmm? Sure, why the fuck not? Yeah, yeah, very funny. You're a sore winner, Von Karma. Dot, dot, dot. Wait a second. Cross-examine the parrot? Is it here? I mean, they imagine you'd be back at the shop. I guess we're gonna have to send a police officer or gumshoe to go get it. Uh, what is it, Nick? No, you're not going to. Your Honor, the defense would like to take Mr. Von Karma up on it. <gasps> of course, we're going to cross-examine the fucking bird. <laughs> I can't. Just let it go. I'm not reading this on his... <laughs> I can't read any of this. Just read it yourself. God. Exactly, Your Honor. I would like to cross-examine the witness's pet parrot. God. Mm. Oh. Order! Order! Oh, oh wow, that my like voice cracked there. Oh, what would you think, Mr. Vonkama? <laughs> Need you even ask? This is a farce. I object. You're the one who suggested it. Wait a second, you were the one who suggested I cross-examine the parrot, Von Karma. <sighs> I think he wasn't, wasn't being serious, but... I have a right to do as you suggested. Oh, God. Hmm. <clears throat> dot, dot, dot. Well, if you're so desperate, then please be my guest. Question or exclamation point? Of course, should you go through with this, and nothing comes of it, then I hope you're ready for the consequences. Meh. Right, we've already lost the case otherwise. Nick, this is crazy. Sometimes crazy is what we need. Well, still want to go through with your little game? Yes, I'm doing it. Sure, I'm not even gonna state. Let the parrot take the stand. I will cross-examine her, Your Honor. Exclamation point! This is the most ridiculous thing I have ever heard. Oh god, Von Karma's wrecked every person's testimony, every piece of evidence except Larry and the parrot. Except the parrot. She's my last chance. Oh god. At least I think so. <laughs> I can't. I would say I've lost my ability to can. But in this case, I think I've lost my ability to parrot. Bailiff! I can't do this was Bring in the parrot. God. Oh, that's a beautiful sight. That's quite a bird! 
please tell <laughs> Oh god. Please tell us your name! I'm gonna have to be like, Polly, please tell us your name. See? Squawk! Dot dot dot! <laughs> name! It's not, it doesn't work like that. Dot dot dot! The witness is ignored! <laughs> <gasps> That's cause she's a fucking parrot! Oh god. It must hurt to be ignored by a bird. Uh, ahem! Very well, witness! Who is your owner? Please, her! Uh, testify for us! That's not how it works, judge! Oh god. Witness testimony, who is your owner? God. At this point, I am actually might as well just go five more minutes and make it two full 30 minute videos. We. Dot dot dot! <laughs> hello! Hello! Scrub! <laughs> God! This is gonna be a wonderful lacrosse exam! How are we gonna even press this? Dot dot dot! Beautiful testimony! 10 out of 10! <laughs> like Skyrim with squawks! Game of the year! <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna set all this through. <laughs> Oh, uh, certainly the most concise testimony. Where so I can't, I can't do judge voice when I'm laughing. Oh, we get to cross examination. <laughs> right. What are you going to do, Nick? Dot dot dot. I, I don't know. What do we do? Well, we first of all we have to say Polly before we him. <clears throat> Boy, cross examination. Who is your owner? God. Oh, hello, oh, Squawk! Let's press that. Witness, you can't just say hello and expect us to get anywhere. We need... We need to, uh, say Polly. Um, I want you to testify. Maya, you talk to her. Or, uh, right, uh, what do I say? Um, see, have we forgotten something? What's your name and what's the safe number? Okay, I'm gonna take a state first. Let's say, have we forgotten something? Well, we need to say Polly first. Remember, two days ago. We, Polly, Polly, have we have we forgotten something? Squawk! Don't forget to six Squawk! I'm finding a Polly to say that here. See, that will uh, prove that the caretaker has something to do with DL six. Um, Polly, have we forgotten something? Dot dot dot! Dot dot dot! Hello! Hello! Squawk! Oh, he didn't say it. Dot dot dot! That, that's not what you're supposed to say! Forgot! Something! We forgot! Hello! Hello! Squawk! Uh oh, it's not working, Nick! She won't say it! That is ridiculous, why won't she say it? Tisk, tisk, tisk! Something the matter, Mr. Wright! Wait, don't tell me Von Karma expected this. Of course he did. He couldn't have retrained the parrot, could he? I wouldn't put it past him, but I'm guessing it's just the parrot being a stubborn piece of shit. Did he train her not to respond when we asked if, she, if we'd forgotten anything? Okay. Dot dot dot. Um, hold it. Witness, you're supposed to speak. You must speak to me. <laughs> dot dot dot. Frankly, I can't believe that you're speaking to the parrot. Well, well, I guess we should try to get some information out of her. We need to show the show the judge that her owner is Mr. Yogi. Oh, I see. Hello, hello, what's going on? Oh, that's back to the first statement. Okay. In that case, let's load the state. And, uh, say, what's your name? Let's see. Maybe we should get her to say her name. See, Polly, Polly, what's your name? God, that's beautiful. See, Polly, Polly, Squawk! See, that's right! I think we've established that this parrot is named Polly! Does this have anything to do with her owner's identity? Uh, of course it does. See, we have, do we still have that, uh, okay, we have the case file! We have the case file still! Karma didn't take that! He only took the letter! And it says, if we check it... See, um, see, let's go forward... See, uh... No, see, after his arrest, fiance Polly Jenkins commits suicide! That's our proof right there! Of course it does! Yes, it does! Dot dot dot! 
Ha! Fascinating! You claim that the parrot's name will prove her owner's identity? I do! Then show us this proof! Nick, don't you think you're taking this bluffing a little too far? I am not! Listen, we're not here to answer the question of who is the caretaker. We're here to prove that he is Yanni Yogi, because we already know that. All we have to do is tie the name Polly to Yogi. Your Honor, the proof that the parrot's name reveals the caretaker's identity is... The DL6 case file. Take that. The DL6 case file? Karma's going to I didn't even bother taking a state. That's quite a large file you have there. Which page is this proof on then? Page number three. Show us or stop wasting our time. Hmm. Very well, Mr. Wright. Please show us the page. Let's see. Where are these files the information connected to this pair's name? Let's see. Case summary, victim data, or suspect data. Um. Uh, let's see, is it if we if, are the pages labeled? Uh, let's see, so case summary, victim data, so suspect data. That's that's the one. Suspect data. It's on the suspect data page. Dot dot dot. Question mark. This page is all the information about Yanni Yogi. Right after he was arrested, his fiance committed suicide. See, and what was her name? Albert Einstein. Hmm. Indeed, it does say that. Yes. What was his fiance's name? Polly Jenkins! Polly! Exactly, Your Honor. To be fair, Polly is a fairly, fairly common parrot name, but still. You remember the name of his fiance who committed suicide? And named his parrot after her. That's why he named his parrot after her! I oh, see! I guess that is possible! Thomas going and checked. Bah! A mere coincidence, that is all. Of course. My granddaughter has a dog she calls Phoenix! <laughs> And let me he, guess, he's going to say, does that prove that I'm connected to her? Well, Mr. Wright, does this make you my granddaughter's fiance? Oh, God, that redirection. Slippery slope and all that goodness. Oh, let me see. She's only, she's only seven years old. Hmm, indeed. Although it is a little weak for evidence in a murder trial. We would need some other corroborating evidence. We would, but that's going to get us to the next testimony, probably. Where am I going to find that? Nick, we're getting closer. One more, if we can just get one more piece of evidence. Right, but what? Hmm. Very well, witness, you may continue. 